Cancers. What up, Cancers? It's your girl here, Miss Hawaii. Coming at y'all to give you your general love reading. I hope all is well with you. And I'm so blessed to have you here today. All right. So let's get into a couple of announcements. First of all, personal readings. Email Miss Hawaii Readings at gmail.com. That is Miss Hawaii Readings at gmail.com. Personal readings do take one to two weeks to get you the reading. If you would like it expedited, you can pay an expedited fee and I will get you the reading within 24 hours. So that is Miss Hawaii Readings at gmail.com. I look forward to hearing from you. All right. Following this reading is going to be the extended reading. All right. The link is in the description box below for you. If this reading resonates, I hope to see you over on the extended. In the extended, we're going to pull your person's cards, Cancer. See how they feel about you. See what actions they'll be taking moving forward towards you. We'll also get advice for you from the universe, so you won't want to miss it. I hope to see you over on Vimeo. Again, the extended reading link is in the description box below. Please follow me on Instagram. My Instagram name is Miss Hawaii Tarot. That is Miss Hawaii Tarot. I'm trying to build the platform on there, so that way you guys have another way to connect with me. All right, I also have started a Facebook page. So if you have Facebook, please be so kind to click the link in the description box below and like the Miss Hawaii Tarot Facebook page. I love you for that. Thank you, thank you. Shout out to all of my members. Thank you for being a member. If my readings resonate and you've been watching me for a while, I expect you to be a member. All right, click that join button. That's a way of supporting this channel and showing me that you care, okay? So I appreciate all of my members. Thank you for everybody that's a member. If you're not a member yet, please click that join button. You get access to different readings throughout the week. Secret readings that other people don't get access to. So please become a member and thank you to all my members for supporting this channel. All right. Thank you to everybody that's donated to this channel. Donation info is in the description box below. Okay. All your donations go towards tarot tools to help me give you a more accurate reading. So I appreciate the love and support. Thank you for all of your super chats. You guys are amazing for that. Okay. I love you. Love you. Love you for that. Don't forget to subscribe to my other channel, Miss Hawaii Scorpios. The link is in the description box below as well. Miss Hawaii Scorpios is the name of the other channel. If you have Scorpio in your chart or you're interested in Scorpios or you just want to be supportive, please go ahead and subscribe to that other channel as well. Okay. I appreciate that so, 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 so much. All right. Don't forget this is a positive only zone. Please don't come on here talking no shit. All right. Let's stay positive towards one another. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if the video resonates. And don't forget to tell a friend. All right, Cancer, so let's see what's going on. Oh, that flipped right over. The Four of Swords in reverse. So I'm hoping that this means that some of you guys are coming out of healing. Let's see what else we got. Some of you are dealing with an air sign, an Aquarius, a Libra, or a Gemini. The Seven of Swords. Ooh. Okay, let's see what's going on with that. More air energy. Yeah, this is you coming out of a painful ending, painful heartbreak. Somebody could have cheated on you. They could have betrayed you. There could have been some deception here with that Seven of Swords. The Eight of Wands. Okay. You got some communication coming in. Some of you guys have been communicating with somebody here. The Two of Wands. Okay. Planning. Some of y'all got somebody new. You've healed from a heartbreak and there might be somebody new here. I'm seeing some good communication between you and this person. The High Priestess in reverse. Let's see what that's about. The King of Cups. Oh, Cancer. That's either you with the water energy or that's somebody else that has a lot of feelings for you already. The Fool. Ha ha. Could be an Aries. Another Cancer. Pisces. Scorpio. Beautiful. One more card here for how Cancer is feeling in love, please, Spirit. One more card. Oh, the Four Cups. Bottom of the deck, we got the Six of Wands in reverse. Okay, um, hmm. let's see what's going on here. It looks like there's some, I don't know why y'all got the four cups. It could have to do with the past person or whoever it was that broke your heart. Maybe you were discontent in a certain situation. There could have been some secrets with the high priestess. Let's see, show me the four of swords in reverse, please spirit. The Five of Swords in reverse. Oh, yeah, you definitely heal it from some past shit. Ooh, the Strength card. Ooh, this person tried to put you through it, huh? Could have been a Leo. Four of Cups again in reverse. Now it's in reverse. 
the three of cups so some of y'all you've healed there was a healing process here from somebody here that it caused you to exert a lot of strength okay they put you through a lot with that five of swords in reverse and the four of cups in reverse you've come out of that regretful mode you come out of um this sad feeling you may have felt or maybe just like a rest period you needed because of what this person put you through and i see you now with the three of cups you now you're ready so some of y'all are you're you're dating you know you're talking to people you're even going out let me see the seven of swords well i feel like some of y'all were isolated for a while or just staying to yourself because of something here this person did or because of heartbreak because you were healing show me the seven of swords please somebody here did you dirty could have been another water sign or somebody here that was manipulative towards you could have lied to you the sun is here leo energy again something came out here about this person something was revealed and it was that obviously that they weren't your happily ever after with the ten of cups ace of cups in reverse also they weren't giving you their cup of love they were being sneaky here and something came out about this person it was revealed to you good i'm happy that you found out sometimes the truth hurts but that's what we need show me the three of swords in reverse the lovers in reverse Ugh, gemini energy that's tough because some of y'all really think thought this was going to be your soulmate your twin flame ace of wands in reverse Oof. yeah it wasn't going anywhere three of swords again in reverse from two different tarot decks forgiving and moving on cancer with the sun again you became illuminated here the sun is about seeing things we didn't see before maybe that the moon was hiding when we see the sun that's about illumination it's the most positive card in the deck for a reason okay um i feel like whatever happened with this person you were able to see clearly and you realized here either this wasn't going nowhere or this person was being sneaky behind your back they could have been cheating on you they could have been lying to you about something either way you got the memo show me the eight of wands the six of cups in reverse this is you letting go of the past quickly too justice because you want to be treated right libra energy here with the page of wands some of y'all got a new interest here or you're just shifting your energy you're no longer passionate about this anymore and it's time to shift your passion as somebody who deserves it because with the justice card you deserve to be treated right and fair okay you realize here this person it wasn't going nowhere maybe some of y'all got a message or maybe somebody could have told you something some of you guys you just became illuminated yourself and you were just like seven of pentacles in reverse it's no longer time to keep invested in this it's time to let the past go and it's time to move on with the future i fucks with it show me the two of wands for real the six of wands in reverse the lovers in reverse Oof. there's that lovers again in reverse gemini energy with fire energy a relationship here that didn't work and i see you guys here shifting your energy wheel of fortune my favorite card in the deck because it's about cycles it's about fate it's about destiny it was destiny here for you to start looking in the future and leave this person behind it wasn't going anywhere with the six of wands in reverse this was a connection that was going down the drain and you know it the lovers in reverse there was a disconnect here and the page of pentacles this is you shifting your energy now with the wheel of fortune i like it show me the high priestess please in reverse eight of cups in reverse the tower in reverse oh boy chariot and an emperor Ooh, with the ace of swords wow so I feel like for some of y'all, there was a resistance here. You weren't listening to your intuition. You may have been listening to what other people are telling, were telling you. You couldn't walk away for a while. You cut your intuition off because you cared about this person. But I feel like it came to a point with the chariot and the emperor that you fucking turned your shit back on with the ace of swords. The universe, this is about the universe dropping knowledge. It's about truth, breakthroughs. And I feel like you did get that. Here's your major arcana card, the chariot. That's about getting past obstacles, moving forward. Okay? And I feel like you, you're the emperor. You took control of your life, control of the situation. Okay? And you were able to make decisions here as an adult. 
Okay, show me the King of Cups, please. Let me shuffle for this King of Cups. The Eight of Swords in reverse. The King of Pentacles in reverse. Oh, boy. The Six of Swords in reverse. So your person, I don't think, can move on. Two of Cups, possibly. Maybe this is you with the King of Cups. Maybe you still care about this person. Some of y'all dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Some of you guys, this person can't move on from you. Okay. Others of you, I feel like it's a process. It's slow healing. This person could have been married for some of you in a whole nother relationship. Look what they did to you. Ten of Swords. This was a painful ending. And the connection was there. Some of you guys felt a soulmate bond with this person. But... Ooh, show me the King of Pentacles in reverse. Five of Cups. Yeah, you went through it when you let this person go. Like I said, a lot of y'all resisted change. Show me the Six of Swords in reverse. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Ten of Swords. Oof. Pain, pain, pain. Oof. I'm so sorry, Cancer. Definitely, you still got love for this person, I feel like. Show me the Fool. The Ace of Pentacles. Yes. A new beginning. Something stable. Something secure. Yes. Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Okay. Some of y'all real focused on your money, your career. The judgment in reverse. Ooh, with the Three of Pentacles. It's a process for you. Okay. Some of you guys are kind of afraid of the unknown, afraid of new. You know what I mean? Others of you already. Um, show me the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Some of you guys are still going through this judgment process, you know, this judgment um, process. It's in reverse. Page of Wands. Yeah, with the lovers in reverse. You still care about this person. You do. But you're realizing here you guys are just not compatible anymore with the lovers in reverse. And Page of Wands, it's time to shift your energy. Some of y'all got somebody new here. Could be a fire sign. Show me the Page of Wands. Could be somebody younger than you for some of you. If you haven't met this person, they could be coming in soon. Yeah. After you heal, obviously. Some of you guys, this person is here already, but you're trying to weigh out your options. You're like, oh, I don't know. I'm trying to focus on my bread. I've been through a lot. I'm trying to work on my self-love. Show me the four of cups. The ace of cups in reverse. Oh, Some of y'all, the universe is trying to throw somebody here at you, but you ain't fucking with it. Y'all trying to stay into yourselves here. Some of y'all, nine of pentacles in reverse. And you know you don't want to be single. But the king of pentacles is in reverse. Show me the nine of pentacles in reverse. The knight of swords in reverse. With the wheel of fortune. Y'all trying to take your time. That's what it is. You don't trust nobody. Okay, I feel it. I feel it. Show me the ace of cups in reverse. You, you're not trying to jump into anything right now. You're still healing from, you know, this past person. Or some of you have healed, but you still just don't want to jump into anything too soon. The hangman in reverse. Yeah, with the moon in reverse. Y'all trying to really take your, take your time here. I don't think there's anything wrong with that. Some of you guys, this is a fresh situation. That's why others of you, it's not. Okay. But I'm definitely seeing a relationship here that did not work out. And then there's a Knight of Pentacles. Cancer, some of y'all got somebody here coming in. Somebody new. But I feel like y'all got some trust issues here. Because of this past situation. Because for some of y'all, this person was very deceitful. They did lie and pretend. Okay. So I see you right now kind of just discontent. Kind of regretful. Still thinking about the past. Maybe there is somebody here trying to come in. But you're like, mm, you're not really feeling the person like that. I understand. All right, let's go into the extended now, Cancer. That's what I got for you guys. Um, the extended, we're going to pull your person's cards here. We'll pull um, this past person here that seems to have been um, deceptive towards you. This person here that it seems like you're letting go of or you still love, but you're trying to let go of because it wasn't going anywhere. And we'll also look into the new person because some of you have somebody new here, but I don't think you're very interested in them um, right now. 
uh, you're still having some trust issues, okay? So, um, yeah, and we'll also get advice for you from the universe, all right? So I love you guys, Cancers. Thanks again for being here in the um, in your general love reading for July 11th, 2021, and I'll see you over on Vimeo. If not, thanks for watching. Deuces. Bye.